actually today we um, we are working to attract those people that typically they say we don't like sports so um, we are trying to talk to them with uh, other words with other way of showing movement like for example dancing uh, dance sessions uh, during weekend in the park is a way to attract people that they typically say I don't like sports but I love to dance so um, this is um, one program that is working really well uh, with um, uh, to attract uh, new people to, to, to movement Global Active City is uh, an accelerator for our programs. Also, is um, give us the framework to understand where we are today, to understand which are the gaps that we should tackle in the future, and how we can redesign our programs to uh, gain more impact. And finally, it's a great opportunity um, for networking with other cities and to learn from other cities uh, their best practices and also to share our best practices with them. Well, for example, we are working with local clubs. Uh, we are um, working together, um, strengthen the, the, the management team uh, of the local clubs uh, the trainer capabilities of the local clubs and giving them tools to, to talk to new members and also to reinforce their relationship with current members. I think the most important recommendation I, I can uh, give to other cities is don't um, impose the program. You have to, to really uh, think what the, the people like, uh, like the dancing example, what they like, they, they should um, uh, find uh, fun uh, in the activities. So when you have this uh, situation, this is the, definitely the, the powerful uh, and the continuity of the program.